This is my review on Need for Speed Payback. Need for Speed is a racing game. When you play it, when you start it, you will end up with three drivers. To say who you will be playing in the game, Matt, Jess or Tierra, and you will do, you do get me number three, it's hard when you get to her. Matt does off-roading, drifting, Jess does police work, Kayla does racing, Raph does upgrading vehicles. Lena, she controls the streets and she will try to stop you taking over the city with the police. At the bottom of your street it will say abandoned cars available, you will have to find them or if you can't find them, look on YouTube and find where are all the abandoned cars are on the map and when you do find them, you take them back to the garage and you will upgrade them to be more faster and better. Taylor does racing tries to take over the world without Lena trying to stop him. Matt does two types of racing, he does off he does off-roading and drifting on off-road, he does racing over crews and gets two off-road vehicles which are abandoned and one drift vehicle which is also abandoned and also race their other crews which their boss calls cars you find on off-road and drift which are also on the map. Jessica does police work and boss work, it's easier but it does get harder when you go through the missions you get more cars and a new one. Raph in the game he will tell you there are some abandoned cars around the map. There is about 160 hours to find them when you find them. Like I said, upgrade, put parts on and put lights underneath your car and more. She works with the police and the house and the outlaw rush, which is a race, which is the best drivers. Lena don't want Taylor's crew to get involved, or the house and the police will be on you and try to take you down in the city. He works with the house and the outlaws rush. Look in my eyes and tell me that you want me no more. You skirt the knife's edge between life and death. What is the price? What is the price? How much do you want? On bosses' cars, you can make it faster, but on normal cars, you can upgrade it and put parts on it. Bosses' cars, you cannot. On this one you can upgrade and put parts on it and skins and paint but it only works online. Look 
in my eyes and tell me that you want me no more. What is the price? What is the price? All of the abandoned cars in Need for Speed Payback. There are some of the abandoned cars you can find on the map in different places. They are quite hidden, so I'll find them. On Need for Speed Payback, you can upgrade your cars and put lights underneath your cars and have different colours, flames coming out of the exhausts. But all cars on the all cars on the game are level three nine nine. You can't level it up up to any other number than three nine nine. And you can also get DLC cars online as well. 